Oh great, it broke. Hey guys, what's up? Crazy RC Maniac here, and I just got back from the local dirt track area of around where I live, and uh, I'm kind of mad because as soon as I turned on my slash 4x4, hit the throttle, backed off, hit the throttle one more time, and boom, there was a problem, it's not working. So today, we're going to be troubleshooting. I assume that it's just a stripped pinion tooth, so in most cases, this will just be a, a stripped pinion tooth fix problem. And uh, so, hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's go. So let me see if I can get a better angle for you guys. This is uh, where the gears are connected to the motor right there. Make sure that's in focus. Okay. So what we're going to be doing today is simply taking this out and uh, showing you guys how to fix the uh, problem we're having. After you get that screw out of the way, what you want to do is you want to get your screwdriver in here like such and just pop off that housing. It may seem like you're breaking something, but you're really not. Just that one screw holds it on. Okay, so what I thought it had happened was that this set screw right here, this one, um, had backed off so that the pinion wasn't spinning with the motor rotor. Motor rotor. That's weird. <laughs> anyway, but what actually happened is that the motor is shifted too far this way, and so it's not actually making contact with that drive gear right there as you can see it's turning without the pinion turning so how we're gonna fix this is we are just going to there's a little screw right here this silver one right here and we're just going to loosen that place the motor back and then we should be good to go so now that that screws loosened off we should be able to shift the motor back on so it's making contact yeah so then what you want to do is just hold that and re-screw that screw back in let's just go test this out really quickly okay so now that we have tested the pinion gear to make sure it is working. We just want to reinstall that uh, cap on it right there. Hope you guys enjoyed this kind of garage video of uh, the Slash 4x4 here. Um, it was kind of thrown together at the last minute because I was about to go run this. Came back uh, with some problems. So I fixed them up right there and uh, we should be good to go. Some bad weather is heading in right now, so I probably won't get to making a running video of this this weekend. Expect one within a week or two, somewhere around there. Sorry, I've been pretty busy lately with school and everything. So, uh, sorry for the lack of videos. Make sure to rate this. Thumbs up if you liked it. Thumbs down if you didn't, if you thought it wasn't good. But if you didn't think it was good, or even if you thought it was good, leave a comment and tell me why. And don't forget to subscribe, because we have some awesome new content coming, as I said earlier. And that's all for this video, guys, so thanks for watching. See you next time on RC Explorer. Peace.